Well, in April 3rd, 1974, I had been at Channel 9 for about three months. Al Shabakati, the legendary news director here at Channel 9, had hired me right out of Ohio University over in Athens as a general assignment reporter. This was a different kind of day. Uh, the weather started out very sunny, very nice, and nothing to indicate that there were major storms brewing. As the day progressed, the forecasts got a little bit more ominous. All of a sudden, sirens started sounding. These were the tornado warning sirens being used for the first time ever. Well, we got down Interstate 70, uh, 75, close to where 74 is now, and then all of a sudden, dancing over Price Hill and over the west side, you could see it. I'll never forget this. We, would, we made, went down the street, we turned left and turned right. Just all of a sudden, everything in front of us was gone. Houses were obliterated. I remember a yellow Corvette being on its top in somebody's front yard. I remember walking into a house, looking up, there's no roof on the house. The clock says 410 when the power went out. Winds were calculated possibly or estimated at 300 miles an hour. The high school was obliterated. The Arrowhead subdivision was just leveled. But there was amazing volunteer effort. Students, kids, you name it, came in pouring in to help with the relief effort. So it was, it was quite something. I have an instant recall of, of it to this day.